Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh and very good morning to our Dr. Rahisham. We, we from group 2, section 3, instrumentation of process control, going to present about our group project assignment, which is uh, to value uh, the safety and the, the economic terms uh, of the PLC programma, programmable logic control. So I will start for the introduction. So let me introduce uh, for our group members, which is me, myself, Zuli Dhamitri, DE201133, Tommy Lin Kian Liang, DE201088, Karti Anak Lelaki Vasutavant, CE190125, Muhammad Shafiq bin Kas Kasmazuli, AE190107. So basically, this is our uh, our assignment instruction which is they give uh, the, uh, the illustration of the tank and we need to to do the PLC program using the software which is uh, the instruction have given in the sentence and we need to do in PLC so this is our result for the first uh, first draft which is uh, the input is uh, the X1 and the X the internal relay is control relay 1 and the output element is S1 for the second one is the input is fluid switch which is FS and for the internal relay is control relay 2 C2 and uh, timer 90 second for the for the tank to fill up fill up into the limit Timer one two zero second, which is T zero one, and timer ninety second for the timer, which is uh, the instruction have given for the timer one two o and ninety. So for the output is drain valve, which is S two. So I will go to the pass for our next member. My name is Karthik and my metric number is CE one nine zero one two five. I will explain you about the weakness of this basic PLC system. The current PLC system is too relied to the fluid switch. If the fluid switch is broken, the operation of the system will be uh, become interrupted. And for the example one, when fluid switch is broken, there will be no input signal in relay one to shut down the input valve. Therefore, the fluid will continuously flow into the tank. In the result, the fluid level keep on increasing and the tank may explode. So I will continue with the example two. First of all, when the fluid switch is broken also, there, uh, there will be no input signal to relay 2 to open the drain valve to uh, S2. Therefore, the fluid cannot drain out from the tank. In the result, the fluid level will keep on increasing and the tank may explode. That's all from me. Thank you. Hello and good day to everyone. My name is Muhammad Shafi bin Kasmazuli and now I will continue the presentation on the improvisations towards the PRC systems. So basically, our group has two suggestions to improve our PLC system. The first one is, we need to put another fluid level sensor inside the tank, which is, it is located at the certain height maximum level, which is higher than the uh, normal level, which is located at the fluid, fluid switch. So whenever the fluid switch having a problems and the S1 valve is still running, so when the fluid level uh, reach to the maximum height uh, level here so the sensor will sense the error in the systems and it will send the signal uh, to the systems and to shut down the systems so it will make sure that the tanks is not uh, leakage or explodes with the water the next suggestion is uh, we need uh, to put a manually emergency stop button at the S2 valve uh, same situations uh, so when the fluid switch have a problems and the S1 valve is still uh, running, so it will, it will make the fluid uh, becomes uh, reach to the maximum level. So to uh, prevent this, we need uh, the workers can stop uh, the process manually by pressing the emergency stop buttons, and the emergency emergency stop button will open the S2 valve here, so that the the fluid will flow out from the tank uh, through the S2 valve. So we can, uh, from that, we can shut down the systems and continue for the maintenance uh, progress. 
So next, the advantage of our improvisations. So we have a, a three kind of advantage. The first one is we can prevent the accident from happens. So we can prevent the tank from explosions or leakage due to due to the some system error. So that if it, uh, the workers is are not having an accidents or having uh, problems with the maintenance works. And second one is we can provide uh, manual solutions for emergency situation, which means that we are not uh, fully relies on the automatic systems, but we also uh, have a precautions on rely in the manual systems, which is the emergency stop button here. And the third one is uh, our suggestions of improve, improve of the PLC systems will go through from this automation PLC to end IoT monitoring and controlling, which means that uh, we need to try an error uh, from uh, the software first so that we can do it physically and to operate the system and make sure it runs smoothly. So that's all for me. Uh, thank you.